is, is, is a great type. Oil is a type of the Holy Spirit of God. El aceite es un tipo de Espíritu Santo de Dios. Because of the properties it consists of. Por las propiedades que tiene. Right? Why is oil good? Why is oil a good representation of the Holy Spirit of God? Porque el aceite es una buena representación del Espíritu Santo de Dios. Thank you for asking. I will tell you. Who wants to know? ¿Quién quiere saber? Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Number one, oil lubricates. El aceite... Um, when you use lubrica, lubrica, when it's used for the purpose that it's needed for. Cuando es, es usado por el propósito que, que tiene. When you lubricate something, there's, there's little friction when things are touching together. Cuando tú lubricas algo, hay algo que tiene como fricción. And, and, and if it's not oil the right way, y si no es, no it tiene can aceite, break. Puede romperse. But not when oil is there. Pero no cuando el aceite ah, está come ahí. on, hallelujah. Those who are lubricated by the Holy Spirit of God will never fracture, will never break. Eso que son lubricados por el Espíritu Santo ellos nunca se van a fracturar o romper. Amen. Who's that back there? That's Madeline. Who's that? Thank you. Amen. You received that word. The reason why we breaking things in our life, our marriage, our children, our job, is because you don't have the Holy Spirit. La razón por qué cosas se rompen en nuestra vida, nuestro matrimonio, nuestros hijos, nuestro trabajo, porque no tiene el Espíritu Santo de Dios. I take it back. You do have the Holy Spirit of God. But you might not be full of the Spirit of God to be lubricated enough. Quizá tiene el Espíritu Santo, pero quizá no está lleno del Espíritu Santo de Dios. Because there's measures to it. Porque hay medidas. Who wants more of oil of the Holy Spirit of God? Quien quiere más aceite del Espíritu Santo. Receive this word in the name of Jesus. Recibe lo en el nombre de Jesús. Oil heals and was used as a medicinal treatment. El aceite sana y fue usado como una medicina. It is said that in Luke ten thirty four, they said that when they heal the sick, dicen en Lucas diez treinta y cuatro, dice cuando sanaron los enfermos, they anointed him with oil also. Ellos también lo ungieron. Con aceite. The oil is good. El aceite es bueno. The word I got said the book of James, I believe. La palabra dice en el libro de Santiago. Is there any sick among you? Hay un enfermo en medio de ustedes. Any in affliction or pain? Al alguno en aflicción o en dolor. Call upon the elders of the church. Llama en los ancianos de la iglesia. That they may come. Que ellos puedan venir. Pray for you. Orar por ti. And anoint with oil. Y ungirlos con aceite. Why anoint with oil? Por qué ungir con aceite? Because this oil represents the Holy Spirit of God. Porque el aceite representa el Espíritu. It's a symbolism of the Holy Spirit of God. Es un símbolo del Espíritu Santo. So your healing, entonces tu sanidad, is not just in the oil itself. No solamente está en el aceite. But in the faith in the word of God that when you put the oil, they will be healed. Pero en la fe la palabra de Dios cuando ponga el aceite va a ser sanado. That's how we know we got some oil in the back if you need some for your house. Por eso tenemos aceite atrás si necesita para su casa. I'm not promoting it, but you could, it's right there. No lo estoy promoviendo pero está ahí. Because it's biblical. Porque es bíblico. See, sprinkling water like Catholics is not biblical. Um, echar agua como los católicos no es bíblico. But oil is biblical. Pero aceite es bíblico. Amen. So así que úntase en la casa entera, el cuerpo entero. So anoint yourself, your whole body, your Amen. house. Oil heals, like I said, and oil lights up when it's burned. El aceite se enciende cuando es quemado. In a lamp. En una lámpara. That means that when the Spirit of God is, there is light. Significa que cuando el Espíritu Santo está, hay luz. You're the lamp. Tú eres la Do you have oil to be burning? Tienes aceite para quemar. Because if you're burning, porque si estás quemando, that means the oil is present. Significa que el aceite está presente. And that means the Holy Spirit of God is present. Y que el Espíritu hey, Santo está presente. All right, back there. But if you're not burning for Jesus right now, pero si no estás ardiendo por Jesús ahora mismo, I have to pray for you. Tengo que orar por ti. You know how are you burning? Sabe cómo sé que está ardiendo porque lo puedo ver. How you react to the word of God? Como reacciona la palabra de Dios. I can see it in your prayer life. Lo puedo ver en tu vida de oración. I can see it when there's worship and you like a muerto like this. Lo puedo ver cuando hay oración y está como tieso. Oh, you don't know how to react to the presence of God. O no sabes reaccionar a la presencia de Dios. That means you need oil. Significa que necesitas aceite. Because you know, see, out in the clubs, and when I used to go clubbing, porque cuando yo iba a fiestas, cuando iba a los clubs, I was the first one in the dance floor. Yo era primero en en la bailando. And the last one out. Y el último en salir. I was there to party. Eh, yo estaba ahí para. Because if I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna go home all the way. Porque si yo voy a ir a la fiesta, voy a ir. Listen, if you're gonna be bad, be bad all the way. Si va a ser malo, sé malo. If you're completo. gonna be a like, prostitute, be the best prostitute to the rest. Si va a ser una prostituta, sé la mejor prostituta. Because God hates mediocre jobs. Porque Dios no le gusta la cosa media. So I said, when I become a Christian, so, yo, yo un cristiano, because I wasn't faking the world, I was real. Yo no era falso en el mundo, and yo I'm era not going to be fake as a Christian either. No voy a ser falso como I'm going to be real 100%. Voy a ser 100%. That's why I dance for the Lord, Por eso yo danzo para el Señor, like I dance in the club. Como yo en el club. That's why I sing, Por eso yo canto, like I shout, como yo grito. that's why I raise my hands when the DJ said, 
put your hands up in the air. Entonces yo levanto mis manos. I was like, yeah, the hands up. Y yo decía sí. Because I follow what the DJ is saying. Porque yo seguía lo que los DJs decían. Well, now I'm the DJ saying raise hands up for the Lord. Ahora soy el DJ diciendo que levanta sus manos para el Señor. I used to throw parties and promote. Yo antes promovía fiestas. My own birthday parties. En los cumpleaños. I would rent a place like this. Yo rentaba un lugar como este. And I was charging money at the door. Y yo le cobraba dinero en la puerta. And I sold my drinks. Y yo le vendía mis mis bebidas. So I got you at the door and I got you in in the bar. Entonces yo te tenía en el en la barra y en la puerta. And I would gather people. Y yo reunía a las personas. I was, I, hundreds of people came to my Cien, parties. It was packed. The house was packed. But I was doing it for the devil. I would put the great music. I would get them drunk. I'm the same guy. Yo soy el mismo hombre. But I'm renewed by the Spirit Pero of God. Estoy renovado por el Espíritu And Santo. now I gather people for, the, for God. Y ahora yo reúno a la persona so para we Dios. can worship together, my para God. Adorar a Dios juntos. So back then I led people for evil. Y anteriormente yo guía a la persona al mal. But now I'm leading you for good. Ahora estoy guiando al bien. Ah, come on, man. You know when you went to the club. Tú sabes cuando ibas al club. You did your hair. Tú te hacías el pelo. You did your nails. Tus uñas. Now these eyebrows, Ahora mustache, son las cejas, el bigote, que crecen por aquí también. la barba. Ah, yo no están aquí, yo ni se ríen, yo tanto santo ya yo. Usted no sabe en el pelo. You don't know about your hair. Don't let me say I can tell, because then they're going to move it in the day. Because I know who's quién se peinó esta mañana o no. Oh, aleluya. You get ready. Usted se alista. For what you anticipated in your mind. En lo que tú anticipaste en tu mente. That was going to be the best night of your life. Que iba a ser la mejor noche de tu vida. Sí o no? Yes or no? Sí, pastor. I live with some people, man, that, that, that got redeemed. <laughs> ¿Quién aquí bebía? Who drank here? ¿Quién aquí iba a los clubs y bailaba? Who went to clubs and danced? ¿Quién aquí fumaba? Who smoked? Come on. Thank you, mother. We're here. Bendigo los santos que no lo hicieron, no lo hagan. I bless the saints that didn't do it. Eso era yo antes, porque ahora soy diferente. That was me back then. Now it's different. Por el punto que nos preparábamos. But the point is that we prepared ourselves. Comprábamos ropa. We bought clothes. Nos ponemos bonito. We got nice, pretty. Para llegar al club. To get to the club. Y pasarla bien. And to have a good time. Entonces cuando era tiempo de beber, ¿qué tú hacías? Usted bebía. And so when it's time to drink, you drink. Y bebía más. And you drink more. Y bebía más. And you drink more. Cuando era tiempo de bailar, when it was time to dance, usted bailaba. You dance. Y bailaba más. And you dance more. Sí o no? Yes sí, or no? Sí, pastor. Entonces para el Señor. And so for the Lord. Do you imagine hoy en día? Imagine nowadays. ¿Cuántos se maquillaron bien? How many put on good makeup? ¿Cuántos se bañaron hoy en día? Who took a shower today? ¿Cuántos pusieron el mejor aceite que huele perfume para Cristo? Who Hallelujah. put the best perfume for for Jesus? ¿Quién se vistió bien hoy en día? Who dressed nicely today? Y anticipó lo que iba a pasar aquí hoy en día. And anticipated what was going to happen today. Porque tú puedes anticipar. Because you can anticipate. Oh, Dios me va a sanar. Aleluya. Oh, today the Lord is going to heal me. Oh, Dios me va a tocar a mí. Today the Lord is going to touch me. Emma, todo el mundo va a estar borracho en el Espíritu Santo y fuego. I'm going to be drunk in the Holy Spirit and fire. Esa es tu especulación de lo que va a pasar. That is your speculation, your expectation. Ahora cuando llegamos a la iglesia, and so when we get to church, las cosas pasan así rápida. Things happen quickly. Porque ya viene con expectativa en tu espíritu. Because you come with expectation. No es que si te diga aleluya. It's not that I have to say say hallelujah or glory to God. Tú vienes ya hallelujah, pastor, vamos arriba. You already come. Pero come with me. Ponga mano, profesai, predique, profetiza. Aleluya. Amen. Amen. ¿Me está entendiendo? Are you I'm understanding? I'm like that for the Lord. Whether you hear or not. Aunque tú estés aquí o no. Yo a veces vengo a la iglesia cuando está cerrado y ustedes no están aquí. Sometimes I come here when the church is closed and you guys are not here. Con Dios. And I come to pray with the, the Lord. Marilyn, yo, Did you know yo, yo that? Aquí dos horas, yo solo con Dios. I'll be here two hours Hallelujah. with the Lord y by danzo, myself. Y bailo, y I'll dance. Un chino, un chino I'll worship. Me pongo la mano y me caigo. <laughs> I lay hands on myself when I fall. Me tiro al piso, me acuesto allí, me siento allí. I sit there, there, there. Unjo con aceite los bancos. I I I anoint the the benches with oil. Y hago de todo, yo solo. And I do everything by myself. Con mi Dios. With my God. Por eso que me respalda cuando estoy solo aquí. That's why he backs me up when I'm by myself. ¿Me está entendiendo? Eso es mi privacidad con Dios. That's my privacy with God. I didn't have to say that to you. Yo no te tenía que decir eso. But I know that it happens. Pero te estoy diciendo qué pasa. You know what my prayer is? ¿Sabe que mi oración es? When I come here, I say, Lord, I pray. Yo digo, Señor, yo oro. And I prophesy. Y yo profetizo. That whoever enters those doors. Que lo que el que entre por esas puertas. Don't be broken. It's a speaker. Chate para acá. Hijo, ponme esa bocina. Put the volume down. Need a sound. Quick. When they enter those doors. Cuando yo entre por esas puertas. That they'll be broken in the spirit. Que yo sean quebrantados en el espíritu. But I pray this prayer. Pero yo oro esta oración. Go to bus number two and put the 
But go to bus, bus two and put it down, the speakers. Hallelujah. Oh, go up there here. Go up there. Just stay up there. Sorry. I pray that when they pass this line right here, this yo, line. Yo oro cuando yo pasen esa Can you see this line right here? Get up if you have to. This line right here. Esta línea acá. I, yo oro que no se contenga. I pray that they not contain themselves. Que aquí themselves. para el piso que van. That they go to the, que, even the floor. Que aquí pasen milagros extraordinarios. That mir extraordinary que miracles happen. Que la profeta fluya como nunca antes. That the prophet flows like never before. Que el que venga aquí con fe. That the person comes here with faith. Se ha sanado. Will be healed. Se ha liberado. Will be delivered. ¿Y qué está pasando últimamente? And what happens lately? ¿Verdad? Pero por qué? But why? Porque hubo una preparación. Because there was a preparation. Yo no puedo un día aquí orarlo cuando no lo he hecho en privado. I cannot come here and pray when I haven't done it in the private. Y así con nuestras vidas. And that's how it is with our lives. Yo te exalta en público. God exalts you in the public. Lo que tú haces en privado. What you do in the private. ¿Me estás entendiendo? Entonces el aceite so the oil es bueno. Is good. Representa el Espíritu Santo de Dios. Represents the Holy Spirit of God. Hoy en día, Nowadays, tú vas a salir lleno de aceite. Dale un fuerte aplauso. Aleluya. Oil in the name of Jesus. Amen. The anointing is what breaks the yoke. It's what breaks the yoke. La unción que rompe las cadenas. The anointing is what breaks chains. Tienes tú la unción del del santo. Do you have the anointing of the holy one? Tienes suficiente aceite en tu espíritu. Do you have enough oil in your spirit? Para echar fuera un demonio. To cast out demons. Para sanar un enfermo. To heal the sick. Mira tu amigo y dile tú tienes. Tell your friends, do you have? Tienes? Do you have? Ay, ay, ay. Oil. Aceite. You get a massage with oil. Tú masajeas con el aceite. Because it's smoother, right? Porque. Hmm? Because it's smoother. And Porque it's más warm. Fácil. And it's warm. Más suave. Es... All right. Anybody here got a massage? Alguien aquí ha tenido I masaje. I guess not. Yes, uh, yes. You with me? It feels good when you put oil. Se siente bien cuando le pones aceite. It's smooth and it's warm. Es es caliente. Because when you use crema, it's, it comes out hot, like a eh, fría la crema, right? Because when you use Pastor, lotion, no, no, it's no, cold. No, 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 put your hands first and then touch me, Pastor. I'll be like that. <laughs> okay, okay. Por de maldad, tú le tiro tres gotica. Ay, así ella. The men know what I'm talking about, okay? The men know what I'm talking about. Pero aceite es más rebanoso y, y calienta. Oil heats up. Que te calma los músculos. It calms down your muscles. Entonces el Espíritu Santo. And so the Holy Spirit. Is what warms you and comforts you. Es lo que te calienta y te conforta. He's the anointing oil. Él es la el aceite. Oil also adorns when applied to us as a perfume. El aceite también adorna como si fuera un perfume. The Holy Spirit adorns us el and makes us more pleasant to be around. El Espíritu Santo lo adorna y lo hace más pla más placente. Para estar alrededor de personas. Because sometimes we stink. Porque a veces hedimos. And we need the, the perfume of the Holy Spirit of God. <laughs> y necesitamos el Espíritu Dilo Santo de Dios. Dilo como es así, hedimos. Te hiedas, si me But why, why? Pero por qué? Have you noticed that some people are not good to be around? Como tú has notado que una persona no because son buenas para stinks? estar alrededor. Because they're like always mad like a dog face Porque or siempre están bravos. Like you're like, hey, I don't want to be next to that person. They, they all around their vibe now. They's not good like they say. Su vibra no está bien. Como dicen que dicen, su vibra no está bien. That means they demonize. That means, significa que están demoniados. But sometimes that's us. That's you. Pero a veces somos nosotros. Sí o no? Yes or no? Oh, no, tienen algo ustedes ya. Van para el cielo. Sí. Porque a veces yo soy así con la pastora Wanda. Yes, because sometimes soy I like rudo, that. Soy rudo. Soy como... Uh, Pronto para irame y tú, pero ¿qué pasó? Sometimes I get mad. Que no estoy orando. It's because I'm not praying. Que no me estoy ungiendo con la aceite del Espíritu Santo. I'm not anointing myself with the Holy Spirit. Entonces me hace rudo como persona. So that makes me a little rough as a person. Y así somos nosotros. And that's how we are sometimes. Con nuestros cónyuges, con nuestros amigos, los hijos también. With our friends or our brothers, sisters. Necesita el Espíritu Santo, el perfume. We need the Holy Spirit, the perfume. Para que sea agradable, para que esté alrededor tuyo. So that we can be pleasant for those who are around. Come on. And when we, eh, eh, you got the message, baby. You got it. That's it. We're here. Amen. So always anoint yourself with the perfume of the Holy Spirit of God. So siempre ungese con el perfume del Espíritu Santo. That when you come out of your, your, your house, que cuando salga de su casa, they smell it. You're like, you, you, think, you look different today. Y ellos digan, oh, usted está como diferente. Is it the glasses? Hoy. Son tus lentes. Is it the hair? No. Es el cabello. Is, is it the new fade you got? No. What is it? ¿Qué es? It's the Holy Spirit of es el Espíritu Santo. God. Do you want some? ¿Quieres? I have some because I'm in overflow today. Yo tengo porque estoy you have to be in overflow. Tiene que estar sobreabundando. Sobreabundando. Sobrebotando el vaso. Rebosando. La única manera que yo puedo ministrar a ustedes the only way I can minister to you es porque estoy en sobreabunda. It's because I'm 
overflowing. You make my cup run over. Tú haces que mi copa rebosije. ¿Verdad? Cuando tú das a otra persona cuando tú tienes el tuyo lleno. How can you give to somebody when yours is beber, cup is full? That también. I can drink and another person can drink as well. Cada día en tu casa, Every day in your home, tú que salir you, can, you have to come out para overflowing. Que se te pegue al lado, so the person that comes next to you, brink, you touch them and they fall back. No mentira, eso es verdad. I'm not lying, Atrévete. it's the truth. Haz una declaración. Make a declaration. Y dice, Padre, en el nombre de Jesús. And say, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Pues después que tú ores y te metas con Dios. And after you pray and La primera persona que yo toque con mis manos. The first person that I touch with my hands. Yo oro hands, que se caiga para atrás en el Espíritu Santo. I pray that they Santo. fall back in the Spirit. En el nombre de Jesús. In the name of Jesus. Tú te levantas. You wake up. Buscando gente. ¿Cómo tú estás? And you go to shake somebody's hand. Un día se van a caer para atrás. Someday they'll fall back. Porque ya está declarado en lo privado. Because it's already declared. Lo que tú no declaras no es tuyo. What you don't declare is not yours. Si lo puedes ver y lo declara, es tuyo. If you can see and you declare it, it's yours. What do you think? That I play games when I say, demon come out, or we prophesy, we pray for the sick? I'm cree, believing it's going to happen. ¿Usted cree que yo juego cuando estoy declarando que una sanidad pase? Yo, yo no, estoy creyendo. Yo no dudo que no va a pasar. I don't doubt that it's going to happen. Yo le creo a Dios con todo mi corazón. I believe in God with all my heart. O con mi carne diga, no, pastor, es embuste, mentira. Okay, somebody says that's a lie. Mi espíritu dice, no, ora, que si está en la palabra, es tuyo. My spirit says, yes, pray that they do the word. Pero lo pongo en práctica, Marilyn. But you have to put it in practice. Hay que muchos que tienen la mano eh, que pueden sanar personas. Many of you have hands to heal. Y aún pueden profetizar la palabra de and Dios. And even to prophesy the word of God. Y pueden sanar a los enfermos. And even heal the sick. Pero no lo están practicando. But you are not practicing. Solamente it. lo creíste y es para ti en estas cuatro paredes. It's only what you read and Pero cuando sale a cuatro paredes. But when you come out these four walls. A la calle a predicar, to, poner la mano a los enfermos. To lay your hands on the sick. Se sanarán. They will be healed. Se sanarán. They will be healed. Ora, cuando salga de tu casa. Pray when you come out of your home. Dile, Padre, dame palabra de consejo. Say, God, give me a word of counsel. De, de, de peso en mi boca. A weight in my mouth. Para cuando yo hable a la persona. That when I speak to people. Lo sientan people, en su corazón. They will feel it in their hearts. Y la palabra los cambie. And the word will change Porque them. Porque muchos amigos de ustedes. Because many of your friends. Y trabajadores, hard in here. Y trabajadores. And even co-workers. Que están enfermos. That they're sick. Que necesitan una palabra. That they need a word. De, de, de aliento de vida. Of, of life y usted callado a la persona, and you are muriéndose. just silent next to the person dice, Ay, pues, mi jefe está malo en día. and you say oh my, my boss is just así, bitter today di, Padre, sana mi jefe hoy en día. and you say instead of doing that Toca you say jefe hoy en día. Lord touch my boss ¿Me está oh, amen. amen praise the Lord hallelujah, hallelujah. wow all your polishes when used to shine metal el aceite también da brillo cuando es usado para brillar el, el metal. So just like that, the Holy Spirit grinds us and shines us up so we can have smooth edges. Y así mismo el Espíritu Santo los, le, lo da brillo a nosotros. So we can have smooth edges. Para que podamos tener las esquinas suaves. Because some of us have hard edges. If Porque we touch it, we're going to scream. Porque algunos, algunos tenemos las esquinas rudas. But the Holy Spirit is smoothing us. Pero el Espíritu Santo le... le So Los people could be around us. Para que persona pueda estar alrededor so de nosotros. So attitude doesn't stink. Para que tu actitud no no apeste. The first mention of oil was in the word of God in the book of Genesis. La primera vez que mencionaron aceite fue en el libro de Génesis. I'm gonna give a little history. Voy a dar un poco de historia. And then I'm gonna go deep into the message. Y después voy a ir más profundo al mensaje. Do you mensaje. want to learn? Usted quiere Amen. aprender. Amen. You want to learn? I'll teach you. I'll teach you. Les, lo voy a Let's go. I'm gonna read in English. You're not gonna read in Spanish. It's too long. You're just gonna afterwards you speak. Getting your Bible in Spanish for those who speak Spanish. Genesis 28:10 through 19. Genesis 28, 28 del 9, 10 del 10 al 19. Okay. So it speaks about when Jacob left Beersheba and he set out for Haran. You can you can just follow me. Just Dice um, de, cuando Jacob dejó a Beersheba y se fue. When he reached a certain place, cuando él en su lugar, he stopped for the night because the sun had set. El paró por la noche porque el sol ve a ve a bajar. So he took one of the stones there and he put it under his head and he laid down to sleep. Entonces agarró una roca para acostarse. Martina se dijo dónde what I'm trying to say. So verse 12 says he had a dream in which he saw a stairway resting on the earth. Él tuvo un sueño cuando vio unas escaleras que estaban en la tierra. With a staff reaching to heaven and the angels of God ascending and descending on it. Había una escalera llegando al cielo cuando los ángeles bajaban y descendían. There above is to the Lord. Y ahí estaba parado el Señor. And from his, he said, I am the Lord, the God of your father, talking to Jacob. Y le estaba hablando a Jacob, yo soy el Señor, el Dios de tu de tu padre. 
Abraham, the God of Isaac. Abraham. Isaac. Abraham, soy el Dios de Isaac. He said, I will give you and your descendants the land on which you are lying. Te voy a dar a ti, tus descendientes, la tierra en que estás ahora mismo. And I'm with you and I will watch over you wherever you go. Y estoy contigo, voy a cuidarte a ti a donde quiera que vayas. So when Jacob awoke from this sleep, Entonces cuando Jacob se despertó de su sueño, he said, surely the Lord is in this place. Él dijo, seguramente el Señor está en este lugar. And I was not aware of it. Y, y yo no estaba um, a atento, atento a, a lo que, está, no a lo sabía. que, lo que pasaba. I'm going to repeat that again. Voy a repetir eso. He said, surely the Lord was in this place. El Dios, seguramente el Señor estaba en este lugar. But I was not aware Pero of yo it. No estaba, yo no estaba al tanto lo que because estaba pasando. you're not aware of where God is. Porque tú no estás al tanto de lo donde Dios está. Doesn't mean he's not there. No significa que él no está ahí. Because you come to church usted viene a la iglesia, and you don't feel the presence of God like as some people are feeling it. Y no siente la presencia de Dios como alguna persona lo siente. Doesn't mean that he's not there. No significa que él no está ahí. You think that when you do bad you sin against God. Tú crees que cuando tú estás haciendo mal tú pecas contra Dios. You think that he's not there. Tú crees que él no está ahí. You think that he's far from you. Tú crees que él está lejos de ti. Because that's what sin does to us. Porque eso es lo que el pecado hace. It makes us feel. Lo hace sentir. Like we're far from God. Como si estamos lejos de Dios. But the word of God tells us that he's even closer to us. Pero la palabra dice que él está más cerca de nosotros. Because when sin abounds. Porque cuando el pecado abunda. So much grace abounds. El gracio la gracia abunda más. You think that when you lie, you steal, you do something bad. That oh no, ya Dios no me quiere más. Tú crees que cuando tú mientes o tú robas, oh Dios no me quiere ya. Is your mind. God is closer to you. Dios ahora está más cerca a ti. Waiting to hear the words. Está esperando escuchar las palabras. I repent of my sins. Yo me arrepiento de mis pecados. He's gonna say you're forgiven, my son. Él va a decir tú estás perdonado, mi hija, mi hijo. Don't think you're closer to God because you're in church today. No crea que está cerca de Dios porque está en iglesia hoy. He's even as close even when you're sinning. Él está también cerca cuando está en pecado. Because are you a daughter of God? Porque usted es una hija de Dios. When my son and daughter behave bad. Cuando mi hijo o mi hija se comportan mal. And they know they're bad. Y ellos saben que se comportaron mal. Are you still their father? Usted no, yo soy todavía su padre. Do you hate them for what they did? Tú lo odias por lo que hicieron. You're disappointed. Tú sabes que. But they're your daughter and your sons. Ellos son tus hijos, tus hijas. So is God with you. También el Señor es he's así. disappointed what you did. Porque quizá él está. But he's waiting for you to pick it up again and keep walking. Pero está esperando que tú te levantes y sigas caminando. So Jacob called that place Bethel. Entonces um, Jacob llamó ese lugar Betel. Which means house of God. Significa casa de Dios. He prophesied it. Bethel. El, el profetizó Betel. You know, every time we move a house to house, cada vez que lo movemos de casa en casa, we change the Wi-Fi name. Nosotros cambiamos um, el nombre del internet. The Wi-Fi. One time it was Bethel that we named the Wi-Fi. Una vez llam llamamos el Wi-Fi Bethel. Because you know God was in that place. Porque sabíamos que Dios estaba en ese lugar. That was in Jersey, right, Prophet? Eso fue New Jersey. When we move to New York, cuando nos movemos a Nueva York, we have entered a new season in our life. Nosotros ent entramos a otra temporada en nuestra in vida. In a pastoral ship. En los pastorales. And, and we pray for this 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 affordable apartment that we have now. Y oramos por el apartamento que tenemos ahora. And we waited for God. Y lo compramos. And God said, "I'm going to give it to you." Y Dios dijo, "Te lo." But we waited and waited. Y esperamos y esperamos. And, and you know what we did, Prophet and I? Y sabe lo que hicimos a Prophet y yo? We moved. We lived in Jersey. Nosotros vivimos en Nueva York. And we moved by faith. Y lo movemos por fe. Because the prophet said they're going to give you that apartment. Porque una profeta dijo que lo van a dar ese apartamento. By December, he said. Um, by the end of the year. So it was November in Jersey. Entonces we estamos en noviembre en Nueva Jersey. With Elijah. And we say, you know what? Let's move in faith. Let's go to New York City. Vamos a ir a Nueva York. So we left everything. Entonces dejamos todo. And we moved to New York. Y luego movimos a Nueva York. We said we were staying in my mom's house for like about a month. Lo quedamos en la casa de mi madre como como por un mes. Because in her house, some Jewish people they bought the building and they were buying them out. Porque su apartamento habían una persona judía que compraron el apartamento. But we were there with our parents. Pero estamos ahí con nuestras pa con nuestras madres. And my mother said, guys, you can only stay till a certain time because if they call us out, we got we all got to leave y mi mamá dijo tiene que quedarse por cierto tiempo porque quizá lo saquen and we said don't worry y dijimos no te preocupes we're not going nowhere no vamos a ningún lugar and neither are you y tampoco tú te vas a ir until they give us that apartment hasta que lo den ese apartamento but it was any minute they could have called to like leave the apartment the house eso fue cualquier minuto que podían llamar para irnos de allá and they never called her y nunca la llamaron and then we got called for our apartment y después lo llamaron para nuestro apartamento and then she got called for her apartment y después a ella la llamaron that's working in my faith. Eso es caminando por fe. So when prophet and I speak about moving faith, entonces cuando la profeta y yo hablamos de mover esa fe, don't count the t-shirts you no have on no the house. No se preocupe por el dinero. You move. Por lo que tenga, muévase. So God gave us a new affordable house, new brand new apartment. Entonces el Señor le dio un apartamento nuevo. 
And we call the Wi-Fi. Y llamamos al Wi-Fi. The Promised Land. El, la, la tierra de la promesa. What is your Wi-Fi name? ¿Qué es el nombre de tu, de tu Wi-Fi? Don't tell me. Don't tell me because you know we we are prophetic. Nosotros somos proféticos. So we do prophetic things. Entonces hacemos cosas proféticas. It's crazy to you. Quizás se, but it's se, logical to us. Quizás es lo, lo, locura para ustedes, pero es lógico para nosotros. Because you call things that are not as though they were. Porque tú llamas las cosas como que lo que no son como si fuesen. <laughs> Mommy Cheeks 98. <laughs> Take it back. Rewind this. Cut this out. <laughs> you want to know prophets? Email back then? Accelerator. Anyway. Um, but, 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 but entonces, what Jacob did was this. Lo que Jacob hizo fue esto. It said that early the next morning, Jacob took the stone he had, placed his head on. Él dijo que la mañana cogió la, la piedra donde estaba acost, acostado. And he set up as a pillar and he poured oil on it and then called the place Bethel y después llamó el lugar Betel. What are we speaking about today? Oil, right? ¿Qué estamos hablando hoy? El aceite, he ¿verdad? Oil on the rock. Él puso aceite sobre la roca. I wonder why. ¿Y por qué lo hizo? Why would Jacob put oil on the rock? ¿Por qué Jacob puso aceite sobre la Because roca? Because what Jacob they had meaning and had purpose. Porque lo que Jacob hizo tuvo significado, tuvo propósito. See, in his days, en, su, en esos días, when Jacob was blessing Joseph, cuando his Jacob son, estaba bendiciendo a José, su hijo, when he was blessing him, cuando lo estaba bendiciendo, he described it in a different way. Él lo describió de una manera diferente. Genesis 49:24. Génesis no se me duerma, estamos aquí mi gente. Come on, come on, quita el aceite de Dios. Genesis 49, 24. Come on. Genesis 49, 24. But this, it says, but this bow remained firm and his arms were agile. From the hands of the mighty one of Jacob, from there is a shepherd, the stone of Israel. La piedra de Israel. Cuando Jacob tiró aceite en la piedra, eso representó a Jesús que es la piedra. Diga Jesús es la piedra. Say Jesus is the rock. Entonces se acostó en la piedra. And so he rested on the que rock. Es Jesús. That is Jesus. Por eso se soñó. That's why he's dreamed. Y vio una escalera. And he saw some stairs. Donde ángeles where angels ascendían. Ascended. Y descendían. And descended. Y Dios habló. And God spoke. Porque cuando estamos recostados en Jesús la because roca. Because we're resting on Jesus the rock. Vamos a ver visiones. We will see visions. Y Dios va a hablar tu situación. And God will speak to your situation. Ah, come on. Vengo a decirte hoy en día que tú repose en la piedra que es Jesús. That you rest on the rock that is Jesus. Dile tú si no reposa. Say rest. Dile te ve cansado. Dile te ve cansado. Say you look tired. Reposa mi hija. Rest. Que te ve el estrés. That you look stressed. El cansancio mi hija reposa en la piedra. Rest on the rock. Confía en la piedra. Trust the rock. That stone in picture represents Jesus, the coming Messiah. Esa roca representa a Jesús, el Mesías. Jesus is the one we are supposed to rest on. Jesús es el que estamos supuesto a descansar. So just as Jacob set his stone up as a pillar, entonces como Jacob puso la roca como un pilar, un altar, so Jesus, the true stone of Israel, was standing in the midst of Israel as a sign standing tall. Entonces Jesús, la piedra de Israel, se paró como una señal. Diga, Jesús es la piedra. Say, Jesus is the rock. Romans 9.33, you could get that one. Romanos 9.23. 33. 33. Can I read it for you guys? You want to know? Yeah. Amen. I'm going to tell you right here. Romans 9.33 says this. As it is written, see, I lay in Zion a stone. Say stone. That causes men to stumble. And a rock that makes them fall, and the one who trusts in him will never be put to shame. Dice como está escrito: He aquí pongo en Sion piedra de tropiezo y roca de caída, y el que creyera en él no será avergonzado. Do you believe in the stone Jesus? Usted cree en la roca que es Jesús? Shout yes, Pastor. I believe in the stone sí, Jesus. Pastor, lo creo. So then you'll never be put to shame. Entonces nunca va a ser avergonzado. But if you won't believe, pero si cree, it'll become a stumbling block that will make men si fall. Pero si no cree, va a convertirse en una piedra de tropiezo. So it's your choice tonight. Entonces tú Decisión. Will it believe in the rock Jesus? En, en creer en las rocas que es Jesús. It will be good for you. Que va a ser bueno para ti. Or you can stumble upon the rock. O, o puede tropezarse en la roca. Matthew 21, 44. Mateo 21, 44. It says, he who falls on this stone will be broken into pieces. But on 
Whom it falls, it will be crushed. Hmm, my God. Dice, el, el, y el que cayera sobre esta piedra será quebrantado y sobre quien ella cayere la, desmun, la desmunizará. ¿Qué tú prefieres? What do you prefer? Que tú caiga encima de la piedra that you rock on top y sea quebrantado en el espíritu that you fall on top of the rock and be broken down in the spirit o que la piedra caiga sobre ti y te aplaste or that the rock falls on top of you and you'll be smashed. Yo prefiero que la piedra I prefer que Jesús quebrante mi espíritu I prefer to fall y me haga un hombre rock. nuevo que quite todo lo malo de mi corazón para que la piedra al final no me pisote y me vaya al infierno. So fall on Jesus. Don't let the rock fall on you. Entonces cáigase ay, sobre ay, Jesús. Ay. No deje que la roca caiga sobre usted. Because God shall raise the humble. Porque Dios levantará al, al humilde. But the proud he looks from afar. Pero al tibo lo mira de lejos. Come on. Amen. Amen. The reality is that mankind can find rest upon the stone. La realidad que él, es que la humanidad puede encontrar um, descanso sobre la roca. As Jacob did, oh, they can stumble over the stone and be broken to pieces by it. O pueden tropezarse sobre la roca y puede ser levantado en pedazos. But we, like Jacob, can place an entire weight upon the rock. Pero como, como Jacob podemos poner nuestro peso, nuestro peso and sobre we, la roca. And we can find that that rock will sustain us for eternity. Y esa ah, roca lo sostendrá por eternidad. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you because you are the rock. Father, we thank you because we trust upon that rock. You are our refuge, my God. You are my strength. Of whom should I be afraid? You are the light of my salvation, my Lord. And we depend on you, my God. As we are also living stones. And you build a spiritual house upon us, my God. Or in us. Father, we thank you because you're the rock. Father, I pray that you be the rock of our family. Come on, prophesy. You'll be the rock in my marriage. You'll be the rock in my life. Be the rock, my God. In the name of Jesus. And the people said, But are we really resting on Jesus? Are we really resting upon that stone like Jacob did? Estamos descansando en esa roca como Jacob. Because if you're resting, porque si estás descansando, there will be open heavens. Va a haber cielos abiertos. You see, because life is, life is too noisy. Porque la vida es muy bullosa. We wake up, we breakfast, take the kids to school, go to work. I'm tired. Come back home, sleep. The same thing, seven days a week, and then church we come broken and sad. Nos levantamos, acostamos, comemos y después venimos a la iglesia triste. Es lo mismo todos los días. It's the same thing every day. But go to that that's different para que eso cambie. What are you doing different so that may change? Que que está haciendo diferente para que esa situación cambie. ¿Cómo tú estás aquí llevándome al diablo? How are you all here the devil's taking me? Tú vas a la boda y dime, primo, ¿cómo tú estás aquí en la vida del pobre trabajando? Someone asks you how are you doing? You say, "Oh, here." Have you not heard that before? Like a poor person. Tú sabes la vida del pobre aquí. Oh, you know the life of a poor person. Ay, pues tú no te digo, ay, te digo, ay, the whole time the corner store. Ellos están profetizando lo que ya son. They are prophesying what they already are. I hope that you're not that person. I hope that you're not that person. ¿Cómo está Marlene? Ah, de caída. Oh, how are you? Oh, I'm down. Tú no eres cristiana, nadie que supuestamente. Aren't you Christian? We could be pressed, but not crushed. Podemos ser pressed, but not crushed. Podemos tener presión, pero no ser aplastado. Aplastado. We can fall, but we're going to get right back up. You get what I'm saying? But that's when we're resting upon the Lord. We just came out of COVID-19. And there was a spirit of fear upon the whole earth. And there was a spirit of fear upon the whole earth. That pandemic killed many of our families. Esa pandemia mató mucho a nuestros familiares, nuestros amigos. I remember going to the hospital, squawk of hospital, seeing the dead body being thrown like they were dominoes. Me recuerdo viendo los las cuerpos muertos siendo botados como si fueran dominos. That was a time to rest upon the Lord. Esa fue un tiempo donde debimos descansar en el Señor. That you wouldn't get COVID. Y creen a Dios que no lo enfermamos. And if you did, you survived the thing. Y si lo llega esa enfermedad. I thank God that I survived it. Tell you never, I'm alive. Te doy gracias que estoy vivo. Because I relied on the stone which is Jesus. Porque yo confié en la roca que es Jesús. Say wow, there was no churches. No había iglesias. You had to rely on your faith. Tenía que confiar en tu fe. 
depender en tu fe. Pastor wasn't there to pray for you. El pastor no estaba ahí para orar por you ustedes. You had to believe that for yourself. Tú tenías que que defenderte tú mismo. Believe for yourself. Now we in a, uh, Ukraine is a war with Russia. Ahora mismo hay una una guerra entre en tu Ucrania y Rusia. Things are going through inflation. Y ahora mismo todo está está caro. What's going to happen next? ¿Qué va a pasar ahora? But are you resting on the Lord? Usted está usted está confiando en el Señor. Are you resting upon CNN? O está ABC. MSNBC. O está confiando en las noticias. Because every time you watch the news, it's always something negative. Siempre es algo negativo. It's nothing positive. Nada es positivo. If you're binging on, on, on CNN all day, you're going to si, have a spirit si, of fear upon your life. Si está viendo una noticia todo el día, va a tener un espíritu de miedo sobre su vida. Están matando, están violando. They're killing, Hay guerra, they're raping. Pandemia. There's war, Ay, Dios pandemic. Mío. Te va a matar tú misma. Te va a... You're going to kill yourself. Porque todo ese estrés en tu vida. Because no. all that stress in your life. Hoy en día miramos queremos más las noticias que lo que Dios ya ha dicho que estas cosas tienen que pasar rumores de guerra pestilencia terremotos señales en los cielos guerra War. Madre contra hijos, hijas contra padres. Mother against daughter. Madre matando hijos y niña. Mother killing their, their children. Have you heard lately? ¿Usted ha about de the mother eso? killing the let me go there. La madre matan los hijos? I mean, you watch news, you should know. Si usted ve la noticia, usted debe saber eso. Ah, bueno. Está bien. Hmm. We might be coming to a full shortage. Pronto vamos a ir en, en una hambruna. Sounds like crazy, right? Suena But loco. These things must happen. Pero estas cosas tienen que acontecer. But what will you do when it happens? Pero qué va a pasar cuando cuando pase? Are you relying on your own strength? Usted está en, um, dependiendo de su propia fuerza. Or in somebody else's oil. O en el aceite de otra persona. Or your own oil. O tu propio aceite. In the midst of all those things, we have to rest on Christ. En el medio de todo esto tenemos que que confiar en Jesús. Among all those notifications, disasters, we gotta be on Jesus. En todos los desastres que están pasando tenemos que estar en Jesús. Let me say it again. Decir, Jesus is in control. Jesús está en control. I want you to say, say Jesus Jesús is in control. Está en control. He is the God of my life. Él, él es el Dios de mi vida. He is the rock which is unmovable. Él es la roca que es inconmovible. Hallelujah, my God. I bless this Sunday. Yo bendigo este domingo. It can be scary. Puede ser, puede, puede dar temor, puede dar miedo. Hmm. Thank you, Jesus. There'll be the days that are coming. Va a haber días que vendrán. Que you don't, not gonna have a job. Que usted no va a tener un trabajo. You might not have no food to eat in the fridge. Quizá no tenga comida en el refrigerador. Because things will be closed, like time of COVID, for Porque example. Porque las cosas van a cerrar como en COVID. If that does happen. Y si eso pasa. What are you gonna do? Qué va a hacer? You have to use your faith. Tiene que usar su fe. And to pray. Para orar. And decree and declare. Y declarar Father, y decretar. I trust in you. Que Jesús, Padre, I have yo no confío food, en ti. But you are my food. Yo no tengo comida, pero you tú eres are mi my comida. bread of life. Tú eres mi, el Father, pan de vida. my children are hungry. Mis hijos están pasando We need hambre. milk in the house. Necesitamos leche We en la need casa. cereal in the house. Necesitamos cereal. And I have no money. Y yo no tengo dinero. And I'm not going to beg nobody. Y yo no voy a rogar Because a nadie. you are my provider. Porque tú eres mi proveedor. So Lord, in the name of Jesus. Entonces, Señor. Oh, you do something, you do something. Oh, algo o haces algo. Or you send somebody with food. O tú mandas una persona con comida. Even the ravens or the birds, like you fed, uh, uh, you fed Elijah in the brook. O hasta los pajaritos que le dieron comida a Elías. Oh, I pray that when I open the freezer, the fridge. Yo que cuando yo abro esa nevera. There'll be milk there for my kids. Va a haber va a haber leche ahí para mis hijos. And then you pray again, Father, let there be milk. And you open it. Father, let there be more. Y sigo abriendo y sigo orando. And one day. Y un día. That milk should appear. Esa comida se va a aparecer. See, you didn't catch that. Usted no captó eso. But when the day cometh, Pero cuando el día venga, you're going to be like, wow, remember that day the pastor said that. Usted va a decir, wow, yo me recuerdo cuando That's el pastor dijo I'm eso. training your faith now. Entonces estoy entrenando su fe ahora so mismo. So you can do it now. Para que lo pueda hacer ahora. So when those days come, para que cuando esos días vengan, you prepare for that. Usted está preparado para eso. One day, when we moved to Jersey, un día cuando nos movimos a Nueva Jersey, we had no money. No teníamos dinero. We moved with $100 in our pocket. Lo, lo mudamos con $100 en nuestro bolsillo. 500, $500. Oh, 500. And that ran out quick. Y eso, y eso se gastó rápido. We didn't have money one time to eat. No tenemos dinero una vez para comer. You know what? You know what happened to me and Wanda? 
¿Sabe lo que le pasó a mi esposa y yo? We didn't have a bed to sleep on. No teníamos una cama para dormir. But we moved by faith to New Jersey. Pero lo movimos por fe a Nueva Jersey. You know what was a bad man of God? ¿Sabe qué fue esa cama? You know those foam letters and numbers you get our kids they don't know how to count and jump on it. ¿Sabe esas? The colorful ones, the mats. I was a bed for a whole year. Fue es como una alfombra donde ponen los niños. Your pastor, nuestra cama, por un año. Where Elijah. We slept on the top of those things. Tu pastor es con sus hijos, estamos durmiendo ahí por un año. One year we're not bad. Un año sin cama. But we were joyful. Pero estábamos gozosos. We were giving God thanks for everything. Nos estamos dando gracias al Señor por todo. That we had our own house. That He was a provider. Que era nuestro proveedor. And every day we said, God, soon we'll be sleeping in the bed. Y cada vez decíamos, Señor, pronto vamos a estar en una cama. Every other month, Father, we believe for a bed. Cada mes estamos creyendo por una cama. You know when we got a bed? ¿Sabe cuándo recibimos esa cama? We, we got to, in a year, to afford the mattress. Barely afford the mattress. En un año eh, pudimos comprar. the mattress. And the one of the daughters that was with us at that time. Y una de las hijas que estaban con nosotros She had tiempo, good credit. Ella tenía crédito bueno. And she bueno. knew our case. Y ella, ella escuchó nuestro she caso. She from the Lord. Ella escuchó del Señor. To buy us a bed. Comprarnos una so cama. So she bought a bed in Bed Bath Beyond. One of these places. The mattress, Entonces ella compró and un, she sent the bed over there. Un colchón y ella lo mandó a nuestra casa. Then we casa. finally had a bed. Y por fin teníamos una cama. I was putting those screws. Father, thank you for this bed, my God. Yo estaba orando, diciéndole gracias al Señor. Poniéndole espaldar, Padre. Gracias por este espaldar, Señor. I was building the bed. Gracias por estas cuatro patas de la cama, Señor. Thank you for these four legs. Building thank the you. bed. Give me God thanks for a whole year I didn't sleep in a bed. Dante la gracia, Señor. That's things you gotta go through. Hay co es, hay cosas que tienen que And pasar. one time there was no milk, no food. Y una vez no había comida, ni leche. There was no money. No había dinero. Because I was working, I was Uber, Uber driver. Yo estaba eh, trabajando como But taxista. I was like barely making money. I was like for the gas and for y the toilet. Like, um, para el gas. But we Casi no still tenía. serve the Lord. Y todavía le estamos sirviendo al Señor. We still never miss a day of church. Y nunca faltamos un día de la iglesia. We were the first one there. Estamos, fuimos and the last ones there. Y lo último se Because echaría. I'm going through. Porque lo que yo estoy pasando. Doesn't determine my worship with the Lord. No determina mi mi adoración al Señor. Porque aunque la higuera no florezca, aunque no haga pan, como quiera yo adoraré al Señor. I will still ah, worship the Lord. But you? Pero tú? Oh, it's cold. Oh, it's hot. Oh, está caliente, está frío. Estoy, tengo, That's tengo sueño. And that built tough. Por eso mi esposa y yo estamos. Like, you were afraid of a little rain. Tienes you... miedo de, de, de la lluvia. That's how we push you guys. Don't Por eso te empujamos. Because the devil will keep using your, your headache, your, your back pain, your little rain, and shine, whatever, not to come to church. Porque el enemigo usa esas excusas para que usted no venga a la iglesia. Many times you went to church hungry. Muchas veces he eh, ido a la iglesia con and hambre. And we will serve the Lord. Y tú le sirves Matter al Señor. Matter of fact, we started going even earlier because there was the leadership class. A, a veces veníamos más temprano porque había una clase de liderazgo. Hear this, and in the leadership class. Y en esa clase. They would buy food, coffee, bread, and juice. Ellos comp comp compraban comida. And we'll rush to go there early. Y los otros íbamos ya que so temprano. So we can eat a piece of croissant. Para poder comer un, un, a piece of coffee. Un pedazo de pan con café. And some fruits that they had. Y algunas like frutas que tenían. Because they had no food. Porque no teníamos comida. And then the, ch my God. And then the church will cook food. Y después la iglesia cocinaba comida. And they will sell the food. Y vendía y vendía la comida. But we didn't have the money. Pero no teníamos dinero. But we were still serving the Lord. Pero todavía le servíamos Señor. They never saw that. Ellos nunca vieron eso. Because the word of God says. Porque la palabra de Dios dice. That when you're fasting. Que cuando estás unido. That when you go through problems. Aunque esté pasando por problemas. You take no oil. Tú tomas and ese you aceite y lo pones sobre ti. No importa lo que esté pasando. Todavía venimos a la iglesia. Y todavía le, le adoramos al Señor. Por eso mis esposos y yo estamos tan fuertes. We, we Porque pasamos por eso ya. Y lo ponían a servir la comida a las personas. Y tenía, tenía hambre. No money. Porque yo no tenía dinero. Y, pero nadie vio, vio eso. No, I won't go home hungry. Nobody offered a plate of food. Nadie le ofreció un plato de comida. But we thank God. Pero le dimos gracias al Señor. And one time we got home. Que una vez íbamos a la casa. Said, y yo dije, Señor, tenés que hacer algo. No Porque no podemos aguantar esto ya. Era mucho, demasiado. And one day we got a knock on the door. Y una vez escuchamos un 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 en la puerta. And there was somebody from church. Y era una persona de la iglesia. Came with a bag of groceries. Vinieron con una bolsa de comida. 
and we said, thank you Lord y le dijimos, Gracias, Señor. because you have heard our prayers Porque tú escuchaste nuestras oraciones. and you have heard our cries y tú has escuchado nuestras lágrimas. but we had to depend on the Lord Teníamos que depender en el Señor. but we got to know God in that level Pero ahí conocimos al Señor that's not what we speak por eso que we speak hablamos, with authority hablamos con we speak in faith hablamos con fe. we want you to go we want you to get up and walk Queremos no matter que what se levanten. but what happens Pero ¿qué pasa? if that will happen to you si eso le pasa a usted, will you survive it usted or, or will you say you know what forget about this walk of faith man I'm going back to the world usted decía, de esto. I'm, Yo I'm me going voy back este to camino. hustling I'm going back to my home girls. Voy para atrás a mis I'm going to my warm bed in my mama's house. A Forget mi, the floor. I'm going to divorce my wife. Voy you go back home. I go voy. back to my house. Voy a mi casa. To mommy and daddy. But we chose to stick it through. Pero decidimos permanecer. Remain. Permanecer. Remain. Permanecer. Remember one day... Um, We had to pay rent. Me recuerdo un día teníamos que pagar la renta. And I was working Uber. Y yo estaba trabajando como taxista. And you know how the, how the, the Easy Pass charges you according how much you pass the tolls. Y sabe cómo el Easy Pass te te cobra. And one day um I guess I passed the toll many times that month. Y ese mes como pasé muchas veces. And we had the money to pay the rent. Teníamos el dinero para pagar la renta. But the Easy Pass charged me the rent money. Pero el Easy Pass me co me cobró el dinero de la renta. And then the lady comes to cut the rent. I don't. I had your rent, but the Easy Pass took my money. Entonces yo dije, la señora vino a la puerta. Yo tengo tu dinero para la renta, pero el Easy Pass cogió mi dinero. She didn't want to hear it. Ella no quería escucharlo. She took us to court. Ella lo llevó a la corte. We had to go to court to fight that case. Teníamos que pelear ese ese caso. And she was a Christian. Y ella era una cristiana. And she attended the same church we attended. Y ella iba a la misma a la misma iglesia. But she didn't have the oil that we had. Pero ella tenía el aceite que teníamos. She took us to court. Ella lo llevó a la corte. And we had to leave the house. Y teníamos que irnos de esa casa. She said you got five days to leave the house. Ella dijo tienes cinco días para irse de esta casa. And what I did as a man of God. Y qué yo hice como un hombre de Dios. I don't care to look to my side. Yo no podía mirar. My mother wasn't there. Yo no podía mirar para acá. Mi madre no estaba ahí. My brother wasn't there. Mi hermano no estaba ahí. But God was always there. Pero Dios siempre estaba ahí. I said Lord, but we serve you. Yo dije Señor, yo, pero yo te sirvo. We love you. Te amamos. Why are we going through this? Porque estamos pasando por esto. It's because of what you're receiving today. Eso es porque And es por lo que estás recibiendo hoy. You're going to go through it. Y un día va a pasar. For her, you're going to go through it. Por ella vas a pasar. For her daughters, you're going to go through it. Por sus hijas. For your children, you're going to go through it. Por tus hijos. We had to leave the house. Tenemos que irnos de la casa. It was it was snowing. It was crazy. It Estaba was... nevando. We had no furniture to take with us, so we no left like that. No teníamos furnitura para tomar, entonces los los fuimos. La cama, we left the bed. Dejamos la cama. ¿Qué vamos a imaginarte? Dejamos la cuna, nos llevamos de la ya la cuna. That's it. We took our our baby's crib. We make up. We went a few phone calls. Somebody said, "Oh, they renting a house around the corner," and, and we came to this little like project houses. Y llegamos como a esta casa de proyectos. And we met this guy that I think was Polish or something. Y conocimos este este hombre. We said somebody sent us and we're looking for a room. Oh yeah. I have one for you. And I said, but, but how much is rent? I think it was like a thousand dollar rent, a thousand fifty at that time. Y lo ofreció una renta de como mil quinientos dólares en ese tiempo. But I had no money in the bank. Y no teníamos dinero en el banco. But in my Chase account, checks would have gone through. Pero en mi en mi cuenta bancaria los cheques pasaban. So I said, what are we gonna do? Pero qué vamos a hacer? He said, don't worry, just give me one rent. You don't have to give me three rents. Y él dijo, no sé cómo porque solamente dame una renta. Y yo dije, gracias a Jesús. So I gave him a check. So yo le di el cheque. With no money in the bank. Sin dinero en el banco. That's called faith. Eso se llama fe. That's called faith. Eso se llama fe. And I said, Lord, I believe you. You'll provide some way somehow. Y yo dije, Señor, yo sé que tú vas a proveer de una manera. And God provided. Y Dios proveó. And we remained in the house for what, a year and a half, two years and a half. Y estábamos en casa por como un año. Limited. I was, I was limited. Estaba limitado. Then Kesia was born in the house. Después mi hija nació en esa casa. Still limited. Todavía limitado. Our pastors lived down the street. Nuestros pastores vivían a una una un bloque. This nice, beautiful house. Vivían en esta casa muy linda con con carro. Living in abundance. En abundancia. While the people who served them and God in the church were being hungry. Y las personas que les servían en su casa estaban pasando hambre. See, God will permit sometimes. Yo sabes se permite ciertas cosas. That people don't see what you're going through. Que las personas no ven lo que está pasando. Don't blame them. No lo culpe. It's that God wants to encounter you. Es que Dios quiere encontrarte. What you're going through right now. Por lo que está pasando ahora mismo. Is that God wants to encounter you. Es que Dios quiere encontrarte. Because that's the only way you sometimes you'll seek God deeply. Porque esa es la única manera que tú vas a buscar de Dios profundamente. Bueno. And then again, we moved by faith to New York. 
Y otra vez nos movemos a Nueva York por fe. What a process, right, prophet? ¿Qué proceso? But I'm still here. Pero todavía estoy acá. I'm still serving the Lord. Estoy al Señor. I'm still working for the Lord. Estoy al Señor. Believing the promises en la that he said a long time ago. Que él dijo hace mucho oh my God, one day when we write that book, it's going to be crazy. <laughs> Un día ese libro va a ser una But I pray that the book will make me a millionaire or something because yo, Jesus yo Christ. Que ese libro me haga o algo. Something, right? Amen. Amen. The oil el aceite will maintain you burning te va a mantener ardiendo no matter what you're going through no importa lo que estés pasando nobody saw that we were going through that nadie vio lo que estamos pasando because we didn't pity nobody porque oh, no estábamos no, pasando no, no, no. pasando pena we comb the hair de la persona lo vestíamos we put bien perfume when we go to church lo ponemos perfume cuando vamos a la iglesia they were saying how come you guys always dress so nice y decían por qué ustedes siempre están vistiendo tan bien we're laughing in the back of our head puh si tú supiera y por adentro estamos diciendo que es Dios que mantiene limpio The oil. El aceite. The oil. Thank you, Iha. You got the message today. We could go home right now. The oil. El aceite. I don't have no money to buy. It took Wanda like four years to buy new panties. Tomó como cuatro años para que me pusiera a comprar unos pantalones nuevos. No panty nuevo. Oh. Oh, you're ready for it, right? We laugh, but it's true. I couldn't provide my wife panties. I couldn't even. Because yo ni podía comprar panties nuevos para mi esposa. The money that came into the house was like for rent for food. It's like we had to live with our money. Porque dinero que venía para la renta para comida. But we were still praising God. Pero todavía estamos adorando al Señor. When it happens to you, if it happens to you. Si eso le pasa a usted. Praise God. Alabe a Dios. I want to end here. Yo quiero terminar aquí. The Holy Spirit switched everything up. I have more work. El Espíritu Santo cambió todo. It's okay. Está bien. But I want to call prophet up here. I want to minister. Pero quiero llamar a la profeta acá. You see that woman? If I was you, I would get up and I clap for her right now. Mujer, si I would get up and give her a standing ovation. Thank you, Madeline. Aplauso. Thank you, Karen. Thank you, Mario. Thank you, hijo. Because you know what that woman went through. When you know people's story, you get to know who they are. You get to love them more. And you get, wow, you really went through that? And you'd be like, wow, my problems are small compared to that. My problems are minuscule compared to that. But I want to minister to you guys today because it's the holy anointing, the oil of the Holy Spirit of God that's going to keep you standing. Que te va a mantener parado el aceite de Dios. Pero you got to seek your own oil. Say that, Pastor. You got to seek your own oil. Tiene que buscar tu propio aceite. Because we could have divorced a long time ago. We could have called the quits a long time Podían ago. Podíamos terminar en divorcio hace tiempo. But the oil kept us together. Pero el aceite nos mantuvo juntos. It kept us together. It wasn't easy. No ha sido fácil. But it was not impossible. Pero no es imposible. It was not impossible. No es imposible. Nobody's going to do it for you, Brother Jelly. Nadie lo va a hacer por ti, Brother Jelly. You've got to get your oil. You have to your oil. Your brother's not going to do it for you. Your father, your mother's not going to do nothing for you. Your father or your mother will not do it for you. Your knees is what's going to get you what you're asking for. Your knees is what's going to get you what you're asking for. Don't depend on mommy and daddy no more. No depend on mommy and papi. You know, the oil is the oil of him. Look at your oil, daughter. That's his oil. You have to look for your own oil. Hallelujah. Jesus, I thank you, my God. I thank you for your fresh anointing oil, Father God. But I pray that it will be poured out upon them today, fresh, my God. In the mighty name of Jesus. Fresh anointing oil, Father. That the oil will keep their lamps burning every day, my God. That there will never be shut off or quenched my God but they always be burning in the spirit Father that no matter what happens food, famine, sickness sickness or disease they will still be on fire for you my God we pray that when we walk through the valley of the shadow of death we shall fear no evil my God in the name of Jesus I pray that today they'll go home seeking their own oil seeking their own anointing Seeking the light never before, my God, because times could get crazy real quick. What then? What you sow, you reap. We sow now because tomorrow we know what's going to happen. But best believe it, one. When you sow, if something happens, you're going to make, you can go to the heaven and collect what you sown. You can reap the harvest in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. Levanta sus manos. Raise up your hands. Say, Father God, 
Fill me with fresh oil. Padre celestial, lléname con aceite fresco. Say, let my cup run over. Que mi copa rebose. Let my fire never be put out. Que el fuego nunca cese. Let me be burning for you. In the name of Jesus. Let me know when I'm walking away from you. So you can redirect me, my God. In the mighty name of Jesus. Fill me right now with your presence, my God. Tell him, fill me with your presence. Refresh me, my God. In the mighty name of Jesus. Say, I receive your oil. I receive your oil of gladness. The oil of joy. I receive the oil of healing. I receive your anointing oil. I receive your Holy Spirit. Tell them, Father God, fill me with your Holy Spirit. That my cup may be running over, my God. Take everything that stagnated me from growing in the Spirit. But fill me today. In the name of Jesus. I thank you, Holy Spirit of God. I thank you, Father. I thank you, Father.